Well, Avery's been fairly um, busy with delivering bits and bobs to me. Uh, this arrived. This is the battery clamp for my Kia Seed. So I did a previous video where I cleaned it up and I gave it a bit of a spray with some paint. So I haven't looked at it since then. That must be a couple of months ago. So this supposedly is the replacement part. So I shall see if it fits first of all and replace it. And there's my lovely finger. Look at that, yeah? I wouldn't recommend closing your finger on a car door. But anyway, it's getting better. So let's go out to the car. Well, here we are. <clears throat> it still looks actually quite reasonable, that. So the first thing to do is for me to take out this bolt. Um, it does look very similar to me, but there's only one way to find out. Okay, so from what I recall, that's a 12 mil. And that's a replacement part, so uh, this one looks like it might be slightly narrower. That looks wider to me, but it's meant to be the same part number. But uh, I would say it looks slightly different. So 12 mil socket to the rescue here. Okay, so that's coming out easily enough. I did grease up that bolt uh, when I tried to remove the rust. So there we go. Let's put that in there. Yeah, it's definitely uh, not quite the same size. Well, we can definitely see <clears throat> that is much larger. We'll compare it. So, I would say we're a good 8mm anyway. There. And, it could be as much as a centimetre different there. The hole does seem to line up so that's okay the question is whether or not this will fit down there without interfering with anything i suppose that bolt might be long enough to uh, hold it in place if it doesn't go down so anyway i'll put, pop that in and see what it's like Right, well that's gone in there. I can definitely see the uh, the thread. The question is, is the uh, is the bolt going to mate up with the thread? So sure that's going into the thread at that angle so I'll need to check that yeah it's definitely not biting oh that bloody finger there so that's quite deep it's much thinner than that this is a much more substantial part certainly thicker gauge so I'm going to have to fiddle with that very slightly I think what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to put this edge more upright against this bit here and then see like 
Maybe like that. Ah, there we go. That is more like it. So that's there. That's definitely against the battery there. Now the question is, is it too high up? I think I'm going to need two fingers to get in there and make sure it's lined up because I'm slightly off there compared to there and that is at a slight angle. So I'm going to line it up first and then see if it clamps. Okay, so that has definitely gone into the thread. Let's have a look in here. It does look like it's against the battery. So I'll put that on. Get the wrench. Change the direction. Right. Battery is definitely secure. Right, so that's uh, some bloody noisy traffic here tonight. So that's definitely in okay. So it's not identical to this one, but it, it does appear to perform the same function. Uh, so let's have a, a final word. So this was the original one that came with the car which had corroded pretty significantly. It's still perfectly functional. There's no problem with that. I had a look at the scrap yards and all of them, certainly up here in Scotland, uh, they were all in this condition. So it wasn't worth getting one from a car unless you wanted it to be in the same condition, which was just a waste of time. So, the other one, the AliExpress one, I'll put a link to the, the item in the description. It was £1.99 including tax, so I think it was like £1.50 something um, before tax and ship... Uh, no, I didn't get shipping because it was part of a choice order. So, um, yeah, the 20% tax has to be added. And... Uh, so it was just under two pounds, one ninety nine or something. But it may have changed price since I ordered it. But uh, yeah, that was quite straightforward. Nothing, uh, nothing too difficult there about that. Definitely looks neater. Um, so anyway, any questions? Just ask. But I think it's a fairly straightforward swap, and you can definitely see the difference in condition. I will keep that, I'll not just throw it away right now, but uh, there's probably no point in keeping it really, but I'll keep it for now. And that's it. So anyway, feel free to like and subscribe, and if you're so inclined, hope you have a good day.